It is extremely important for communities of color and other underrepresented groups to participate in clinical research trials because what we know right now around treatment for cancer is based on individuals that are not necessarily from those groups. You know, I think it's so important to have um, good inclusive uh, participation in all kinds of clinical trials. Minority populations have been underrepresented for the longest time. We need the complete picture. We've had a partial picture for decades, and what that results is in is certain drugs not working as effectively for some people versus others. And so we're tired of that. So for me personally, it is about not only advancing the science, but advancing the science in everybody. One of the myths um, in the healthcare community around diversity and clinical trials research is that individuals from communities of color will not participate in clinical research. Unconscious bias is something no one wants to admit that they have, but we, we all have some, some type of unconscious bias, uh, and it, it can really hurt us in, in our work. I had a good friend and she said, don't let them experiment on you. And I said, what do you mean? She said, you don't know what they're giving you. I said, I don't know what they're giving me in the regular course of treatment either, but I do know that I want a chance for life. So my hope for the future of advancing inclusive research is one in which everybody is benefiting. With my story and what I've gone through, it's gonna definitely help um, the next person with um, breast cancer. My hope is that um, every clinical trial recruitment mirrors the community, that every patient population can look at a trial and the trial result and say, yes, I was represented.